At the time, somebody said, oh, these young people is because they don't have work. That's why they say God called them into ministry. But when they began to see the fruits, fruits. oh, pastor, <laughs> and then from pastor, the man of God. <laughs> from man of failure to man of God. This, these persons, um, they have got to that point in life where they are confused about purpose, about their vision, about their next steps. And a, a few scenarios I hear, I was able to extract from the yeah. multitudes that mm. we got. Um, somebody here is talking about the fact that he has a call on his life. He, he heard God call him. Yeah. He's a medical doctor. He earns very well in the UK. He has a family back here in Nigeria yeah. and he takes care of them. So the black tax thing, he still pays their bills yeah. and he's very comfortable because he earns well. But now that God has called him, he feels like he's going to have to go and start from scratch. He's confused. Yeah. He's afraid that you know, <laughs> if he starts ministry now, you how, know, will he, how will he survive? Yeah, how is he yeah. going to take care of his family, yeah. his old parents and his siblings and all of that? So it's at that point is he doesn't know what to do okay and so he's asking for direction how how would he navigate this there's someone else who is working in a bank and he says he doesn't find fulfillment that every time he receives his salary he, he feels troubled you know even though it's a huge salary yeah, but he knows that he's something not supposed to be at to the do. bank mm. and then someone else says at what age really should i find purpose is it when i'm 15 13 or when i'm 40. Yeah. Uh, let me first um, begin from a platform of a lesson I learned just maybe two days ago. Uh, you know, there is seed which generally should produce fruits. But that can be likened to vision, seed, and accomplishment, fruit and the natural thing and expectation is that oh once i have vision i should get fulfilled it should get resolved yes. but the seed must go to the soil and take root the seed is meant to produce fruit but on one condition it must take root good seed Strong roots, great fruits. Mm. Good seed, strong roots, great fruits. Yeah. While you keep your expectation that you get the f- fruits, don't pass the process of patience for the root. Yes, and believe me, sir, if you genuinely want the fruits, that process can never be bypassed whether in industry or ministry yes, the same story yes, every man of great accomplishment will tell you the same story so while you desire the fruits that others bear you must learn the patience that they pass through this is where the major problem is you must take fruit downwards before you bear fruit when God shows you your future, suddenly it appears he has taken it away from you or taken you away from it. You now begin to see what appears to be contrary. And that's when the test of your faith and your vision comes in. That even though I'm not yet seeing the result, Something in me is burning that it is there. Yes, so you build up zeal, you build up drive, you build up patience, perseverance. Yes, you want to stop, but that thing won't let you stop. It's driving you to the point that you don't feel what's happening to you outside, but what is burning within you is what is directing you and driving you. The moment of when people feel people have forgotten you, people have left you alone, it happened to all of us. When I was privileged to start the, uh, uh, the church work as assigned, 
Nobody asked after me. But when they began to hear of the fruits, they not only began to call, they began to address me with a different name. Are you following? <laughs> At the time, somebody said, oh, these young people is because they don't have work. That's why they say God called them into ministry. But when they began to see the fruits, fruits. oh, pastor, <laughs> and then from pastor, the man of God, <laughs> from man of failure to man of God. My God. <laughs> are you following what I'm talking yes, about? Sir. Oh, George, we hear that you are going to start your own uh, media house. Yes, sir. Well, let's hope you'll do it. And left you. No call, nothing. Yes, sir. But when they began to see the fruit, yes, they began to look for you. Now, the time of root is a hidden time. Because it's under. Under the soil. Under. Nobody sees it. Yes, sir is getting rotten. It's like reversal. Now, think of Joseph. God gave him several visions and then began to take him away from the vision. And that's also a moment for you to put your eyes away from the vision and put your eyes on the giver of the vision. You see, there is the caller, the called, and the calling. The caller is in between. I mean, the called is in between the caller and the calling. The mistake we make several times in ministry is that we fix our eyes and talk so much about our calling. So the caller say, well, let me leave it to it. Leave it to it. Go and try. But when we talk more about the caller, then he helps us to fulfill the calling. Yes. He empowers it. So sometimes it's like some people are so driven by their vision that they forgot the source of the vision. God was trying to teach Joseph to make him his focus. So they took him away from the vision, removed his, his very colorful dress which represents his vision, sold him out after putting him in the pit, bringing him out. And when he felt he was having some respite, he hadn't finished the school. Then somebody rose again, accused him of inf infidelity and uh, 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 rape. So from then to the prison. But one common thing, and the Lord was with Joseph. Yes, sir. With mercy, maintained his focus on God. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And so when he got there, tendencies for pride, for anger, for uh, revenge, he had lost it all. And so sometimes we need to go through all those grinding processes for us to lose our human and natural tendencies pride, arrogance, mistreatment of people, lack of compassion. And believe me, until those things are lost. You cannot have a sustainable ministry impact. Mm -hmm.